Hello guys, I hope you are doing really really well. Today I have with me the S Pen for Samsung Galaxy S23 Ultra and in this video I am going to talk about top 18 tips and tricks for using this S Pen. So guys, let's start. The first tip is about creating notes on top of the videos. So for example, you are having a lecture or you are watching some kind of video and you want to take notes at the same time. So how you can do it? So for example, I open the gallery, I open this video. Now what I can do is I can just press this S Pen button. I bring it closer to the screen. I press the S Pen button. It will open the air command. The first option over here is create node I just select it so a new node will open and you can make your notes you can start taking your notes now you can see this node is blocking uh, the video behind so how you can solve it just select these three dots okay and select this option of opacity okay so this is opacity option just select it once you select it it will show you a bar so you can just reduce it okay so now i will start reducing it and now you can see you can see the video behind okay so you can see okay and in the meantime if you want you can take your notes as well okay you can also change its size okay and you can reduce it you can change its position as well the second thing is if you want to record your notes and you also want to record the video behind what you can do is you can use the screen recorder option so you just uh, bring down this notification panel and here you see this screen recorder option just select it once you select it it will ask you to start recording here are different settings that you can do so i just select this start recording option so after this countdown the screen recorder will start and you can record the video behind and you can also uh, take notes and it will record both of these things okay so here you see all the screen recording tools are available over here okay so if you want to use the pen from the screen recorder you can also use it if you want to highlight something okay and then if you want to take notes if you don't want to use it you can just work on your notes okay so for example here in the new page i can make my notes the next thing is once you finish you can just stop it so the video recording is stop and it will automatically save in your gallery so i will open the gallery now okay and i will show you so here is our screen recording so you can see so this is how it looks like okay so i am taking my notes it is also recording it and it is also recording the video behind it the next tip is about screen off memo so for example i just lock my screen and now i am in a hurry to take notes so what i can do is i can just take out my s pen from the phone so you can see if i take it out it will automatically open the notes for me and here i can write okay i can book appointment i can take anything okay so i can take my notes okay and then we have different options over here so for example if you want to change the color you can change the pen color okay and then if you want to change the thickness you can change the thickness as well okay if you want to use the eraser you can use the eraser as well okay and once you finish you can save it and it will save in your samsung notes the next tip is about a one tap memo so what you have to do is for example you are in a hurry and you have your s pen with you what you can do is just press this s pen button and tap one time on the screen so once you tap it it will open the notes for you and here you can also make your notes okay all the options are available and once you finish you can also save it and it will save in your samsung notes the next step is about using s pen button to unlock your phone so as you can see my phone is now locked so what i will do i just press this s pen button one time and it will unlock my phone so now i will press it okay so you can see i press it and it will unlock the phone and it also bypass the security lock so how to enable this option so first of all you have to go into the settings okay once you enter into the settings just go into the advanced features okay so once you enter into the advanced feature just select this option of s pen okay once you select it then you have to scroll down and you see this option of more s pen settings 
just select it once you select it the very first option over here it says s pen unlock okay so you have to enable it so once you enable it it will ask you for your pin or pattern so whatever security you have you have to put it okay so for example i will put my pin okay and then i press done so you can see now it is enabled and now you can use your s pen button to unlock the phone the next step is about taking screenshot with s pen button so for example you want to take a screenshot for example i open this website okay and i want to take a screenshot now what i will do i just press and hold my s pen button okay so i just press and hold it okay so i will show you so i press and hold it and you can see it take the screenshot for me and here if you want uh, you can edit it you can write it and once you finish you can also save it okay you can also share it in different platforms so if you want to enable this setting you have to go again okay into the settings icon once you enter into the settings just go into the advanced features once you enter into the advanced features select this s pen option okay and in the s pen option select this air actions okay once you select it you have to scroll down and you will see this option of press and hold pen button so just select it once you select it here you see this option of screen write so you have to select it once you select it everything is done now you can easily take screenshot for example i just press and hold my s pen button okay so you can see it take the screenshot the next step is about smart select so for example uh, i open this website okay and you want to take a screenshot of some specific area so for example i want to take the screenshot of this text this part of the text so what i will do i just open the air command option then i select this smart select option okay now what i can do i can select any area of the screen so i want to select this text so i will just select this area okay so you can see so now you can see it just take the screenshot of that specific area now i can do two things the first thing is if i want to copy this text i can use this text icon and it will copy for me okay and then i can use it in my notes or wherever i want i can use it the second thing is you can directly save it as image in your gallery so what you can do is you select this option of save and it will save into your gallery the next step is also so about taking the text and adding it into samsung notes directly so for example i again use this website and i want to uh, take uh, this text okay and i want to put it into my samsung notes directly from here i use my s pen okay and i just simply select it okay so you can see i am selecting it so i select till here now what you can do you can see there is a small window appear over here you can just select this option of add to note so i just select it once you select it it will directly add it into your notes okay so if i just maximize it so here you can see it directly add into my notes here if you want you can do all your editing if you want to write something you can do it if you want to use uh, this highlighter you can also use it okay so you can do all your editing the next step is about taking notes over different apps so for example i open this galaxy store app now i i'm in a hurry and i want to take notes so i just press my s pen button and i tap on the screen two times okay like that so you can see it will open the notes for me and here i can take my notes i can change its position and i can also change its size okay so once you finish you can close it and it will automatically save into your samsung notes the next step is about handwriting to text okay so for example i open uh, internet browser okay and here i have this website okay but i don't want it what i will do is i just select it okay and then i clear it okay and here i can use my s pen to write any website for example i write here google.com okay so you can see it will convert it into the text and once i select this go option it will open the website for me directly so you can write anything and it will convert it into the text for example i can also write here okay so you can see i will show you so if i write here so it will also convert it okay so i write hard anatomy and it convert it into the text and from here i can select it and i can open my search the next step is about dragging and dropping the image and text from internet browser into samsung notes so i will open the samsung notes 
okay and then uh, on here you see this edge panel i take it out and i open the internet browser in the split screen mode okay so here for example i search some images okay i can easily drag and drop it into my notes i can just uh, press and hold this image and i can easily drop it into my notes okay and then if you want you can also change its size if you want you can also rotate it same way if you want you can also drag and drop the text okay so for example i have this text okay so what i will do is i will just open a new page okay so you can see so this is a new page and then i will just select this text okay i just select it directly from here and then i can drag and drop it as well the next step is for example you open this website and you want to take this full website into your notes okay you can also do it so you can see over here once i open this website here it will show me the link in the notes and it say link or whole page so i select whole page so i will just select it so it will start adding the whole page of this website into your samsung notes so i will show you how does it look like so here is our website okay so you can see over here and now you can see it will directly bring whole website into my notes okay so including the images okay so basically this is the samsung notes okay so now for example i make it big okay so here is my samsung notes okay with the full website and if you want to write you can write here okay and then you can make it bigger or smaller you can also put the highlighter if you want to edit some text you can also insert your text okay so all the tools you can use the next feature is about translation option using your s pen so for example uh, i open this site okay and here i have some text and i want to translate it so what i will do i just select this air command option i just select this translate tool okay and then here you can see it says english to french okay so you can change the language as well okay and here you can select the text or you can select these lines okay so i select these lines so now what i will do is i just select uh, some of the lines okay like that and i want to translate it i just bring my pen closer to the screen i just hover it uh, to the screen and you can see it convert my english into the french okay so here is the french text so this is how you can uh, convert it and then if you want you can also add it to note you can copy it okay and um, you can select it you can share it as well the next step is about multitasking and it's called a uh, glass mode option so for example i open uh, this app okay and now what i will do i just uh, select this air command option and then i select this glass mode okay so i just select it so you can see a small window appear uh, about that app so what i can do i can open any other app okay and then what i can do is i just hover my pen closer to this app okay and it will open the app directly and if i remove it okay and it open the other app so you can see so this will be really helpful for cross referencing okay so you can use two apps at the same time like that and it will be really helpful in the multitasking the next step is about writing on calendar so what you can do is just select this air command option and then here you see this write on calendar okay so just select it so once you select it here you see the calendar will open okay and then here at the bottom we have all the tools available now if you want to write something for a specific date if you want to make some kind of appointment you have some exam you can write it so you can see it is very small what you can do is you can pinch it to zoom and then here you can write easily okay so you can see over here so you can write for your class schedule you have exams you can make all your productivity on this calendar using your s pen the next tip is about writing on video so i will open uh, the gallery okay and then i open this video now what i can do is i can use this pen icon for editing so now i just select it once you select it here you see there are different tools available you select this emoji icon okay just select it so once you select it here you have the option of draw so you can draw live on your video so you can just write it okay if you want to write okay and then you can also change the color okay so you can have different colors okay so whatever you want you can do it over here so once you finish you can press this done option and then if you play it so it will show you like that 
okay so you can see this is how it looks like the next step is about using your s pen for drawing so if you are interested in drawing you can use the pen up app so just select this air command option and then just select this pen up app so here you have different options you can use it for coloring you can use it for drawing so if i just select this coloring okay so here for example i just selected and i can start coloring okay so here you can see we have different coloring option so you can use it for coloring okay so you can see over here okay so you can use it you can also use it for drawing so there are different drawing tools are also available the next step is about magnify okay so for example i open the internet browser and i have different images but if you want to magnify them you can use the magnify tool so just select this air command option and here we have this magnify tool so you can just select it and then once you bring your pen closer to the screen if you just hover it to the screen you can see it will make it bigger for you okay like that okay and then same thing for the text if i just select it and here you have some text so you can bring closer to the screen and then you can see it will make it bigger for you and you can also uh, change it so here you can see it says 150 percent you can make it 300 percent and then if i just bring my pen closer you can see this is how it looks like Okay, so you can use this magnify option as well. The next step is about air preview option. So for example, I open the gallery and I have different images over here. So if I just uh, bring my pen closer to that specific image, okay, it will show me a preview. So here you can see, this is how it looks like. I just bring my pen closer to the screen and it will show me the air preview. Same thing for the videos. So if I bring my pen, it will turn on the video and there are share tool and delete tool are also shown okay so this is the air preview option by just hovering your pen closer to the screen so guys this is for today's video i hope you like the video i hope you enjoy the video so please subscribe to my channel thank you very much